Juma Segawa Tamale is one of the many Kampala residents who accused Kampala City Council Authority of fraudulently parceling out and leasing their land to other people. Tamale says the land on plot 99A to 107A on Najivubo Road opposite Chiseka Market belonged to his father. We acquired that land in an exchange. From, we were shifted from the new tax park premises where my father, the late Haji Tamale, had a plot of land operating a lorry park. As I was processing letters of administration, then the fraudsters came in. I reported to the Bamugamirei Commission. I was among the first people to report, but no response. I went to Kano Nakalema to show how they undervalue property, how the Nachivubo Channel plot is uh, under threat. No response. The executive director of Kampala City Council Authority, Engineer Andrew Chitaka, acknowledges the cases of multiple ownership of land titles in Kampala and other challenges such as KCCA land board giving out gazetted land. We have had a particular problem in the Nachivubo Channel wetland where we wanted to do a road linking Binayomba in Bugolobi to Bukasa in Muyenga. We found that someone had gotten titles in that wetland. In fact, we have been forced to change the road that we are supposed to do and substitute it with another in much in the division. As a way forward, the Ministry of Lands organized a consultative meeting with stakeholders to assess the work of its zonal office in Kampala. Titles are created off the system manually from somewhere, I don't know where. The continued redundancy of the Naguru Nakawa land that was given to OPEC Prime Properties Uganda to build a satellite city is also a bone of contention. The land, which has turned into a den for criminals, is now a major temptation to land grabbers. The body people hide Sidea. Recently, a girl maybe wanted to lose there for a short call. Two boys raped a girl. Besides the cancellation of erroneously issued land titles, the Zono office hopes that computerizing their operations will make land grabbing history in Kampala. The issue of land in Kampala is very sensitive and emotional, with most of the contention coming from the issuance of fake land titles, land titles in wetlands, and misplaced land titles at the land's office. However, it is hoped that the meeting between the Ministry of Lands and KCCA will help to streamline the operations of the Zono office in Kampala. Gillian Nantume, NTV.